All right, we're gonna start off with this house. Roof is looking good, it's pretty dirty. But you have a lot of uh, trees in the way that needs to be cut back. You need to have it three feet off of the roof. The neighborhood is in the 80s. Nice and quiet, working class. Brick front. If you want to paint the exterior, you're looking at probably about 25, 3,000, somewhere around there, because it's a lot of brick, but it's you're not going to paint the brick, just the fascia and trim boards. You got a glass door in the front here. Large living room right in the front here. Got a brass ceiling fan. Go ahead and keep the floors. There's a transition piece that you're going to need. How you doing, man? You're going to be in the video. <laughs> All right. Kitchen. All the appliances stay. You got a silver fan. Dishwasher stays. Refrigerator, if it was cold, stays. Come on in here real quick. You're gonna have to have a couple extra dumpsters. Each dumpster is about 500 bucks. I don't know how much of this stuff is gonna be left behind. I wanna make sure I did turn that light off. And this water heater is 1996. Uh, yeah, I did. It looks good but you're probably gonna to wanna to replace it just because of the age. You don't want any phone calls. Here's your electrical box. There you go. It needs to be labeled. We're gonna to go to the outside real quick. All right, you got some vinyl siding on the side that needs to be pressure washed. So you might be able to get away with not painting it, just pressure washing it. Fence does need to be repaired. All right. There's all your gas, logical. It's a digital meter. The box is large enough, as long as you don't keep that hot tub. You keep that hot tub, you're gonna need to put a new extra box for the the amount of amperage. So this is an addition that they put onto the house a few years ago. Your roof looks pretty good for the back side. Again, you need to cut off all the cut back all the trees. Three feet off of the roof. This white rock is uh, for uh, water drainage. It's like a, it's not a French drain, I don't think, but I think it's definitely there to protect it from uh, the slab falling down anymore. <clears throat> this uh, AC is older. I've considered going ahead and replacing it. She said she's had it for 17 years and she's had no problems with it. I don't see any rust. It looks fairly good, actually. Door shed. The door is kind of hard to open up. You could probably fix that by tightening up the hinges. But it's just, you know, basic for your uh, tenants. Right. This is your backside clean out for plumbing. That step is something you're gonna to have to fix. Probably put some kind of a concrete step or another set of blocks or something as a landlord.
replace this carpet. This room looks to be, I mean at the max, 15 by 15 for your numbers. Nothing looks pretty good. Cabinets are all brand new. I don't think you really have to do anything with this.